Hey, what's happening guys? Today we're going to do another classic circuit you should know. In this case, it is a transistor latch circuit. So <clears throat> to do that, we need two transistors. We need an N channel and a P channel. We're going to use a 3904 as our N channel and a 3906 as our P channel. And the reason I'm doing that is because the pinouts match. Emitter, base collector, emitter, base collector. And I marked the directions there. So you can see the flow. <laughs> All right. So this is a really neat circuit. We'll start with our positive rail. And then we have our ground rail. And this is going to be plus 5 volts DC. Okay. We're going to put a 10K current limiting resistor coming from VCC to the collector of our NPN transistor and the emitter will go directly to ground. Then we're going to use a 4.7K ohm resistor here on our switch just to kind of give us a little buffer on that base so we don't jam it open too hard now that's side one let's get to side two coming directly From VCC, we have our PNP transistor. And by the way, this is Q1, this is Q2. Okay. And it's going to come down here to our LED, which goes to a 220 ohm resistor all right so now the base of our q2 our pnp gets connected to the power source with the 1k resistor just like that after that 10k and then, here's where the magic comes in. So as it stands now, what's going to happen is when you close this switch, Q1 is going to start flowing, and it's going to ground the emitter of Q2, which is going to allow it to flow. But as soon as you let go of that switch, it's going to go off. So what we are going to do... is we're going to take a pull off of that right there, add in another 4.7K ohm resistor, and bring it back to the base of Q1. That way, once Q2 starts conducting, we have a feedback loop here. And that feedback loop... We'll keep this one conduct, we'll keep Q1 conducting. And remember, Q1 is our NPN, Q2 is our PNP. As long as this one conducts, this one conducts, and our latch stays on until we remove power. So here is our circuit. There's our 10K resistor. There's our 3904. There's our 1K resistor, 3906. Our two 4.7Ks, one coming from the switch, the other one coming off the NPN or the PNP over to the NPN to the base. That's our feedback loop right there. And then we have our output going over here 
to the LED, which goes through a 220 ohm resistor to ground. Now all we have to do, hook it up to our power supply, which is set for five volts. Press the button, and it's that simple. No matter what I do at this point, you know, short of removing the power from it, nothing will happen. But once I press the button again, it's back on. So that is a two transistor latching circuit. I hope you guys enjoyed that. It's a really simple circuit. It's a classic circuit, and you should know it. What do you think about classic circuits? Should the people know the classic circuits? If they should know the classic circuits, don't say anything. Remain silent. Even Dogley agrees you should know classic circuits. All right, guys, that's it. I'm out. Peace.